that's the end of the show. Um, yes, your question? You, because it is this this is what this show is about it's about people not being responsible even the tiniest amount like you just said there's a sliding scale she could have went and got help she's saying why didn't she go get help before she killed her baby why wasn't she making this max effort you know why they're here the both of them he knew what he was doing they thought they were going to get a free ride. They were going to come here. They were going to get money. They were going to get this. That's right. That's why they're here. Do you think did you, his reaction, was that a normal reaction? No. From a man that's expecting a, a, a baby? Well, that, would you mind standing up? No, that's, I, what, what, what I'm glad is, honest to God, when you, when you first started speaking, I was scared. I thought you were going to be one of those people, Steve, you were too hard on her, and that's no, no, no. not the way to treat her. You know what? I cannot, to me, it's unimaginable. I have two children, right. and I can't imagine killing your own baby and being so nonchalant about it, not caring. And then this goof up here, he right. finds out that the woman, and now you were saying, what do you do? You said, well, actually, I'm looking for a job, but I used to work in a hospital in the Quad Cities, Rock Island, for 20 years, 13 in mental health. I read right through this whole game in what you're good at. You were on the street 12 years. You read through these people, but I just wanted to say that's... Uh, sorry. That's okay. That, uh, really, you can go and get sliding scale. They will treat you for free, but sterilize yourself. I did that. I mean, I have two kids, and I was older. I got divorced. Right. Sterilize yourself. And w but the thing is, don't especially with this addiction, don't you have to say at some point, I want help, I'm going to stop, please help me stop? She's not saying that. And he's dumb. He knew what she was doing. What do you, you know what? You make your bed in life, right? right? You're sleeping with somebody that's a crackhead, a crack whore, that does nothing but lie and do uh, drugs. All. He knows that she was doing the drugs. He's the, he wasn't fooled. He knew exactly what she was doing, and he allowed it. Just so selfish, but it's commonality. The one thing drug addicts have and abusers have is they're selfish. That they could be rich, poor, on the street, or rich, but they're selfish. And, and what she did, it's what they sad. all do is they try to turn themselves into the victim here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Set furnishings provided by... Rent-a-Center. We make it easy to make it your own.